the day after the update, there's so much to cover today, so let's hop right into it. So to start things off today, there will be more car modifications in the future. Here are two upcoming mods. Mega Booster attached to the rear bumper of the car, and the Scooper attached to the front bumper of the car. So, uh, yeah, that's really cool. And like I said in the video yesterday, this is setting up the future for more car mods and weapon attachments possibly coming in the future. So yesterday I was talking a lot about the Alloy and X Fortnite collab, and they actually have some more information about it today. So Alloy Cup only on PS4 and PS5, April 15th is when it's going to happen. There's only one style on here that is going to be PS5 exclusive. Um, I believe it's one with the mask. And this is going to be a cup only for PS4 and PS5. But after the cup, there's going to be in the item shop. Just the style for the PS5 only is not going to be in the item shop as well. It's just going to be the skin, the emote, and the wrap, the pickaxe, the back wing, and the glider. So, pretty cool stuff right there though. So this is actually a style that's going to be PS5 exclusive. Uh, the first style is going to be uh, available to anyone who buys it in the item shop. So the next thing that we're going to be talking about is actually involved with Sony. So Sony actually bought um, a part of Epic's type of plan. So as you can see on the screen here, it shows Epic Games just announced that Sony invested another $200 million into Epic Games to support their long-term vision for the metaverse. So if you haven't heard about this yet, uh, they're trying to make a metaverse out of Fortnite. Uh, not really a, just like a game, but like a whole entire community uh, overall. So that's pretty cool because if a metaverse actually were to come true, then this would be more than just a game. It would become more of a community, more of a uh, gathered effort. And uh, I think that's pretty cool to think about that this could be like a... Not really... It's not really a game, but just in general it would be really cool to find out. Um, you know, there's a lot of stuff that they're planning. I don't really... Uh, know exactly what they're planning, but I know they're planning some type of metaverse. So that's pretty cool So what I'm gonna show you next is actually about Travis Scott I'm, I don't want to get your hopes up because uh, there was a lot of stuff about Travis Scott a couple months ago He was updated and everything that he was gonna be in the item shop very very soon Well, it never really happened. So these could be false uh, Take it with a grain of salt, but let's hop right into the information about Travis Scott in the skin so as you can see directly from my book says Travis Scott's shop, shop section was updated in the two possible release dates are April 23rd which is exactly one year after the event or April 30th which is Travis Scott's birthday. So I personally think that Travis Scott's birthday would be the more reasonable uh, time that it would come out if it were to come out. Uh, but once again this was updated before and nothing happened he never came uh, back into the end shop. So once again take this with a grain of salt but on to the next topic. So as you can see here, it's kind of in between a lot of tweets, but uh, it says Epic might be planning to start giving rewards for reaching specific levels in today's patch. They added a thing called reward item asset per level, but it's empty, unused for now. So this could come in the next update. This could come in a future season. This could come never. Who knows? Uh, as you saw, it was empty and was unused for now. Uh, but this possibly could be something new that you could be getting something new every single uh, level after 100 so just similar like to the battle pass where you get uh, a reward every single tier you go level up this could be just like that so tier 101 you could get an emoticon tier 102 you could get a banner tier 103 you could get an emote honestly those are just some examples but like that could happen in the future if this is what it seems like it's going to be because it says per level it doesn't say uh reaching a specific level like you know with the selectable styles of the different battle pass skins that we already have uh, for getting to level 225, you get like the runic version of Raz. That's that's something different because that's a specific level. This is per level. So uh, yeah, it would be pretty cool if they have like a battle pass after the first battle pass, which is kind of confusing. But uh, yeah, it would be pretty cool if they do add that. So as you can see on the screen, these are all the new hot fix strings. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn uh, set name, which is actually for the collab of with Lara Croft, Fortnite, and um, Alloy. Uh, we also have includes loading screen. Alloy has landed on the island. So all of these strings got hot fixed, um, which basically means that they're going to be showing up in the game at some point, uh, one way or another with the text. So the next thing that we're going to be talking about is uh, Fortnite. I actually posted this on their Twitter. They said, learn about the Batman Fortnite 0.DC comics series. 
First comes out 420, which is April 20th, uh, six days from now. Comes with a bonus redeemable code for the Rebirth Harley Quinn outfit. Available digitally through DC Universe Infinite, US only, or in stores. So I'm going to go ahead and read off the article. So to start off the article, it says, Universe Collide Batman Dash Fortnite Zero Point New Limited Edition Comic Book Series arrives April 20th. By the Fortnite team. A crack splits in the eye above Gotham City, a tear in reality itself. This rift pulls the Dark Knight into a bizarre and unfamiliar world. With no memory of who he is or where he came from, DC's Batman has been drawn into Fortnite. As our heroes fight to recall his past and escape an endless loop of chaos and struggle, he'll come to face to face with the likes of Renegade Raider, Fishstick, Bandolier, and more, while the world's greatest detective strives to make sense of this strange new world. He'll uncover the shocking truth about the island, what lies beyond the loop, and how everything is connected to the mysterious zero point. Uncover secrets never before revealed in-game or anywhere else. Every fan of Batman, Fortnite, stunning art, and the edge of your seat excitement won't want to miss the caped crusader facing off against Fortnite champions on the island in a desperate attempt to save not only himself, but other familiar faces from the DC Universe and perhaps the multiverse too. So continue on with the article, Batman slash Fortnite Zero Point Issue Number 1. Batman slash Fortnite Zero Point Issue 1 arrives at your favorite comic shops or digitally to DC Universe Infinite, US only. On April 20th, 2021, Issue Number 1 launches day and date in North America, Germany, Italy, Mexico, Brazil, Spain, and the Zeke Republic. There are plans to release the full series in Japan, Korea, and France later this fall. Following issue number one, the next installments will arrive twice monthly in May, May 4th and May 18th, and June, June 1st and June 15th. The six-part series conclude with a thrilling finale on July 6th, which I'm pretty sure is around the time when season seven is supposed to come out. Each print issue of Batman slash Fortnite 0.1 include a redeemable code for bonus DC themed Fortnite digital items inspired by the events in the comic. Starting with the new Rebirth Harley Quinn outfit, as an additional additional reward, any player who redeems all six codes from each of the six comic books issues will unlock the new armored Batman Zero outfit. So here's actually the last part of the article. Here's a first look at issue number one plus a sneak peek into what to expect in issue number two. Issue number one, April 2021, uh, 2020, or 2021, April 20th. Uh, this way you can see the sneak peeks on the uh, video now. And I'm going to go ahead and pause it if you want to see this and look at it in depth. I'm going to go ahead and get to the next topic. So the last and final topic of this video, Evan Assist says, The Fortnite Evan TS reward for Chapter 2 Season 6 are the following. Championship 2021 Emoticon. Fortnite Champion Series Chapter 2 Season 6 Spray. Secrets of the Ancients Loading Screen Number 1 Purple Cell. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, you will receive them one by one for watching each week on Twitch. So uh, make sure you go and get these free rewards. They're pretty simple to do. All you need to do is go to a channel with drops, and then uh, if you keep on watching it, you'll basically get these free rewards in game. If your Fortnite account is linked with Twitch, so make sure you do that first. Then watch all uh, the people that have a bunch of drops on their Twitch stream, which like Nate Hill and uh, people like that. Make sure you watch them to get the drops. And uh, yeah, if you guys did enjoy, hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Hope you guys enjoy this news uh, refresh. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that happened today, and uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed and love day. Peace.